Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, home of the Steelers. We're expecting this one to be one of those good ones as we get set for this matchup between Dallas and Pittsburgh. And now to Tom Hammond and Chris Collinsworth for the game. Tom? We couldn't have asked for a better day for football as we get ready for today's game. Welcome, everyone. Tom Hammond and Chris Collinsworth here with a call. Austin takes it at the four. How do you see this one playing out, Chris? Both of these teams really need to have a good mixture of run and pass to be successful. If either one of them gets too one-dimensional, it really plays into the hands of the opponent. Drops back on first down. Nearly picked off. He should have had that one. What a play by the defender. And the quarterback really caught a break on that one that that wasn't intercepted. Dallas comes out with an I formation. Subscription to your favorite magazine. Looking to throw. Huge pressure by the defense. He's pushed out at the 36-yard line. Nice pass for the quarterback on that one with the defense bearing down on him. Nice play there. It's only seven yards, but that's the kind of underneath throw that eventually opens up some throws down the field. Little handoff. They will be short. Got a couple, but will still be short of the mark. Yeah, and for a minute it looked like he might slip out of there, but uh, the defense got there. The pursuit was all over it, and they made a nice stop. Gets it away cleanly. It'll go out at the 39-yard line. Six DBs in the lineup. Blue under, under, under. under. He drops back. Gets it off. And he makes the tall grab. That was a nice catch. He went up leaving his body susceptible to the hit, but he came down with it and got a first down. And there you see just a little bit of how tremendous these athletes are in the NFL. The ability to go up above the defense and make a play like that, that was fun to watch. Completed. And he just got hammered. Ward gains just about a yard with a short completion. That'll make it second down. The Cowboys have a lot of standouts on defense. Here are just a few. Watch the switch. Set. Blue 30. Blue 30. Set. It comes left. Turbo, turbo. Alert run. Alert run. Drops back. Rolls right. Makes the catch. And they get him up to 21. The quarterback just rifled that one in there for a good game. Everybody knows about this guy's arm strength. And if you wanted to see an example of it, right there it was. Black 20. Black 20. Hey, what? Cut. Feeds it to the back. He's tackled at the 21-yard line. Maybe a yard. That brings up second down. They'll face second down and 10. Ball on the 21-yard line. Hey, watch the screen. They motion to the right. Looks to pass. He's running out of time. No completion that time, and it'll bring up third down. More alone in the backfield. You're the winner of a pair of one carat diamond earrings. Black 20. Black 20. Under. 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 Hey, it's out. It's out. It's out. It's out. It's out. Back to throw. All kinds of pressure. Out of bounds around the 22-yard line. He stopped short of the line on the play. That play was really all about defensive pursuit. They saw the ball thrown. They got there quickly for a loss on the play. Right down the middle. Good kick that time as he puts it right through. The kick is away. He'll take it from the two. They get him at the 25. They could do nothing against this defense on their previous drive. 
They'll go to work at the 25, first and 10. The Steelers bring in the nickel packing. Romo goes with the play fake. Brought down at the 30. Five yard pickup on the play pass that time. Second and five, ball on the 30 yard line. Romo comes up to the line. Three wide receivers split out wide. Tackled right around the 30-yard line. That looks like a one-yard gain. And they really ran right into the blitz. That's a time that a veteran quarterback should have changed the play at the line of scrimmage. You could see the blitz coming. He didn't audible and only came away with a short gain. Hands it off. The defender gets him to the ground. That was a poor series for this offense. Yeah, the defense barely had to even break a sweat on that one. Defensively, when you can take an offense and get them off the field in three plays, that's pretty good stuff. He punts it. It'll go out at the 43. The last time they took the field, they were able to come away with three points. First down now and 10 to go. Offset eye formation in the backfield. Feeds it to the back. He tries to spin, but he's brought down. Parker picks up about seven yards on the halfback counter play. They'll come out in the eye. Here we go. Black 20. Black 20. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Keep coming. And straight ahead we go with the fullback. Gains his way to the 40-yard line. That was a pretty nice pickup by the fullback. Yeah, I have to admit that would surprise me and I think it surprised the defense as well. May have even surprised the fullback that he saw that kind of a hole. Big pickup in a first down. Here we go, baby. Blue 30. Blue 30. Under, under, under. Let's get off. Parker gets the carry. Dropped behind the line. Looked for a seam, but he wasn't able to find anything. And let's give credit to the defense. They had a great push there. They got in the backfield, took control of their own gaps. Left call, left call. Black 20. Black 20. They'll give it off here. Cuts back and he's dropped. Got maybe a couple of feet. Not very often in a game does a defender get a clean shot like that on a running back. Typically, the running back didn't see it coming to take that kind of a shot. He's looking to throw. Gets the pass away. He's brought down at the 28-yard line. A good pick up there. Yeah, there's about 50 or 60 percent of the quarterbacks in the league that would have seen that little hole and said, uh-uh, I'm going to dump it off to the back. But this guy believes in his arm strength. They'll keep it on the ground again. Stiff arms, and he's brought down. Parker comes away with two yards on the carry. Second down and eight. Ball on the 26-yard line. And they'll line this one up with two tight ends. Blue 30. Blue 30. Watch go. Watch go. He'll get it again. And he will lose yardage on the play. The offensive line didn't get much of a push on that play, and the runner was stuffed. Well, that's what happens when defensively you get every gap covered. There is simply nowhere to go with the football. No chance for the running back that time. Roethlisberger drops back to pass. Makes the grab. Knocked out of bounds right around the 22-yard line. Well, the pass was completed. They'll still be short of the marker. You know, I just don't like that stuff, Tom. I, I call that chicken offense. You know, you go out there and you, you act like you're afraid. You're afraid to throw an interception. You're afraid to, to go for it down the field. You just settle and you bring the punter out. I, I don't like that. The kick is up. He's got it. 
Solid kick that time, and he puts it right through the uprights, converting for the field goal. Decent kick. He'll take it from the two. Hit and dropped at the 29-yard line. Their last drive ended with a three and out. The offense will take over at the 29-yard line. It's first and ten. Looks to pass. And he catches it. Tackled around the 45-yard line. Nice little pitch and catch with the wideout. Patience for a wide receiver is just so key. He's able to manipulate that defense, set him up one play, come back with the exact same look and break off of it the next. Beautifully run. Drops back on first down. And he caught it. He's tackled at about the 47-yard line. Around an eight-yard pickup on the slant route that time. Romo is in the shotgun. He has three receivers split out wide. He's looking to throw. Short throw to the right. Pass completed. Brought down at about the 45-yard line. He just couldn't make anything happen after bringing that one in. And that play is really all about the closing speed on defense. They'll let you have the completion, but then they close quickly and make the play. Throws it short. Catch is made. He gets knocked out of bounds at the 41-yard line. And that will be enough for the first down. You know, it really wasn't a horrible call that time by the defense. But anytime you have to try and stop an offense like this in those medium yardage situations, you really have to come up in the coverage. Barber gets the ball. Makes a cut. And he will be hit and dropped. Gain of three. That'll bring up second down. Romo is under center. They'll come out in the single back formation. And they'll run him again. He's dropped at the 37. One yard gain on the play. And so it'll be third down. They'll line it up again on third down. The Cowboys come out with the offset eye. Drops back to pass. Strong throw. Great open field tackle. Brayton picks up seven yards and a fresh set of downs with that reception. Playing quarterbacks just like playing golf. Sometimes you get in a rhythm, and right now this quarterback is getting hot. Back to pass. He needs to get the pass off. Deflected and broken up. Oh my, the quarterback is lucky that one wasn't intercepted. Yeah, you try and fit some of those into some tight holes and every once in a while, you're gonna get one pick, but that was a pretty good play by the defense. He drops back under heavy pressure with the catch. And he made a great open field tackle. Good pocket presence shown as the quarterback was able to get rid of it just before the pressure got to him. Good vision shown by the quarterback on that play to find the open man. You could see him looking around, then checking it down late for a nice pickup. The defense has him surrounded. They get to the QB. I'm guessing field goal here. It won't give them the lead, but it'll get them closer. Pittsburgh looks like they're sending everything but the kitchen sink at this punter. He gets it away. It'll go out at the 11. They had to settle for a field goal on their last drive. They take the field again, looking to put up another score. Lining up with three wide. Feeds it to the back. He's brought down around the 16-yard line. 
Parker gets six yards on the carry. So second down now, the offense needs about four for the first. He's looking to throw. He's under a heavy rush. Tackle right around the 26-yard line. Good gain on the pass to the running back. It's tough to pay too much attention to a running back in the passing game because at least half the time they're staying in the block. So when they do slip out, occasionally they can hit you for a big play. Drops back to pass. And they're coming after him. It's incomplete. The running back can't quite get to that one. And the halfback was open on that one. The quarterback just missed him. Roethlisberger lines up in the gun. He has three receivers in the formation. Black 20. Black 20. Look on the run. Hang up. He'll get the call again. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. A pickup of less than a yard. <laughs> that was a big shot right there. You talk about getting your bell rung. That was the Liberty Bell ringing that time. Blue 30. Blue 30. He drops back, dumps it out right, caught out of bounds, incomplete. The receiver was out of bounds when he made the catch. Not a perfectly timed throw that time. Held on to it just a little too long and led the receiver out of bounds. It's away and it's a booming punt. And they make the fair catch. They had to punt it away on their previous drive. They line up at the 26. They line up in an eye. Here's the give. He's dropped at the 32-yard line. Barber gets six yards on the play. Second and four now. Ball on their own 32. Dallas lines up in the offset eye this time. Play fake. All kinds of pressure. Nice job of the defense to force the incompletion by bringing pressure with the blitz. Yeah, they brought the blitz and the offensive line just unable to pick it up that time to force the incompletion. He drops back to pass. Throws on the run. Brought down at the 41-yard line. A decent pickup on the pass play. Yeah, and that's frustrating for a defense. They had good coverage on the play. The receiver just found a way to catch that one. Drops back. Dumps it out left. And it's caught wide open. He's pushed out at the 47-yard line. And that one will go for a first. And really top-notch quarterbacks know how to throw a football in there without leading his receiver into trouble. That was a great throw. He's dropped for a loss. Loss of two by the halfback. Loss of two. They line up at the 50. Dallas lines up in the offset eye this time. He fakes it. He wasn't set when he threw. And they get him around the 28-yard line. Nice job by the quarterback to hit the tight end for a decent game. You know, tight ends may not come up with those real explosive plays down the field all the time, but they sure are a nice target for the quarterback. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 28-yard line. Romo is lined up under center. Only one man back here. They'll give it off here. 
Brought down at the 24-yard line. Barber gains about four yards on the play. From the 24-yard line. Single back formation. Barber, the ball carrier. He's dropped at the 18-yard line. That was an impressive run for the first down. With defense is so focused on trying to make offenses one-dimensional and take away the run, anytime you see a gain of six yards and a first down, that's pretty impressive. Fullback on the inside give. And they get him at the 13. So that's a gain of about five, and that will bring up second down. Dallas lines up in a double tight set. Still a lot of time left, but at the end of one, the score is 6 0. Tenth play of the drive. On the ground with a tailback. He lost yardage on the play. Well, they wind up in reverse that time. Good push by the defense. And when the defense gets that kind of penetration, it just disrupts everything for an offense. They have to get that guy blocked. Dallas uses motion. Delayed handoff. Brought down around the 12-yard line. Jones comes away with about two yards on the draw play. And it splits the uprights. And we'll take a quick look at the drive summary. He kicks it. Hit and dropped at the 30. They were forced to punt on their last drive. They'll take over at the 30. It's first and 10. Offset I formation in the backfield. The counter. He's dropped at the 39-yard line. The offensive line really got a good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. The Steelers come out in a two tight end set. It's the tailback. He's brought down right around the 40-yard line. Parker gets a couple, and that will be good enough for the first. The backfield is in the offset I formation. Parker, the ball carrier. He's hammered in the backfield. He was caught with nowhere to go. This is a pretty good running back, and if you can hem him up like that, pretty impressive. From their own 41-yard line. They'll come out in the eye. Regular, regular, regular. No, no, Blue 30. No, no, no. Blue 30. Go make this run, baby. Let's roll, let's roll. Under, hey, under. Looking to throw. He throws on the run. Newman intercepts it. Brought down at the 46-yard line. What an interception by the cornerback. You know, some of these corners are just freakish athletes right now. Oftentimes, they're the best athletes on the field. Maybe they don't have the skill set, great hands, great moves, whatever, but they are definitely among the fastest in the NFL. He looks to throw on first down. Oh, that's just sloppy. The intended receiver just got laid out. Boy, that was a big hit. I'm not surprised at all he couldn't hold on to that one. One man backfield. Regular, regular. 
Come on, buddy. Come back. Come back. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. About eight yards there. Well, they brought the blitz that time. The offensive line did a pretty good job recognizing it. They got the blocks, but the back was still able to get out of there for a nice gain. They hand it off. It appears to be short. They denied him the first down on that run. Yeah, they were lucky just to get back to the line of scrimmage. I don't like the call when you're in a third down situation. I'm paying the quarterback so much money. He's getting the ball there. McBriar kicks it, and man, did he get a leg into this one. The ball will go into the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback and his receiver were clearly not on the same page last time, and it led to an interception. Black 20. Black 20. Under. 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 Hey, we got to watch the ball, First down, looking to throw. He's there for the catch. He's tackled around the 23-yard line. Nice job of shutting down the first down pass. Yeah, it looked like that time the defense knew exactly what was coming. They were right there from the outset to make that play. Drops back. On the run, he throws it. He took a shot at the 27. Pick up a five on the play. Hey, no need to force it. He just took what the defense gave him there, found the open man, and picked up a few yards. There's a play fake. Short pass to his left. Tackled around the 34-yard line. Great job to haul in that first down pass. This team is just so good at executing those short, quick passes and picking up first downs and keeping drives alive. He needs to get the pass off. One-handed catch. And they get him at about the 39-yard line. The tight end came up with a nice catch that time. Pretty athletic play for a big guy. I tell you, as a quarterback, you see somebody make a play like that, you want to come back again and again. Black 20. Black 20. Drops back on first down. And he's hammered at the 46-yard line. So I have to ask, what happened on this play? You know, it's difficult for an offense and an offense's ego to admit that you can't block somebody. But there are certain guys in the league that you just have to commit more people to block and, and don't let it bother you. You've got to protect your quarterback. Scans the field. Steps out at the 44-yard line. Not much of a gain at all on that completion. What happened on that one? Well, I think the offense really just trying to make a safe throw rather than taking a big chance and throwing it down the field. You get the ball in the hands of your receiver and let him try and make a play. That time, nothing there. Roethlisberger back to pass. He's been perfect on this drive. Finally knocked out of bounds at the 12-yard line. Just a little dump play, and he uses his speed to pick up huge yardage. And from the quarterback standpoint, nobody sees in the statistics that that was just a little pass and a great speedy receiver out there. All they see is a nice big game. Offense with first and 10 once again after that big game through the air. Drops back to pass. Fires it out. Tackled at the five-yard line. Pretty nice read on that play to find the open man. Yeah, the two of them really have been working hard, building a rapport in practice, and now you're starting to see some of those results out here on the field. Roethlisberger with the give. Brought down at the three. A couple of yards there. That'll bring up third down. Roethlisberger is under center. He has two tight ends. On play action, 
He's hit hard on the play. They had a tough time picking up the linebacker on the blitz. We're starting to see a lot of these kind of guys come in the league, those who specialize in rushing the passer. So you'll see the defensive coordinator move them around a lot up front so that you can't be specific on who's going to try and block these great pass rushers. The kick is up. It's good. Not much doubt as he puts that one right through the upright. Not a bad kick. Gathered at the six. Hit and dropped at the 31. They could do nothing against this defense on their previous drive. Dallas goes with the ace set here. Barber takes it up the middle. He's brought down around the 32-yard line. Gain of about a yard. That'll bring up second down. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 32-yard line. Back to throw. Gets the ball away. He's dropped at about the 39-yard line. The slant pattern is good for an eight-yard gain on the play. Short yardage situation here. They'll need a little less than a yard to convert. All right, here we go. Don't let your man make the play. Wait, wait. Oh, we want the and they'll try and get the first through the air. Brought down at the 48-yard line. That was a great diving catch. You know, sometimes a quarterback can make a wide receiver look good, and sometimes the receiver makes the quarterback look good. That time, that receiver made a brilliant catch. He throws left. And they get him at the 42. A gain of six yards on the play. Just a simple throw and catch for a gain of six. That's just the kind of passing play that this offense is built around. Again with the carry. He'll be brought down behind the line of scrimmage. I don't think the offense expected the safety to come up on the ball like that. Well, you know the safeties are going to attack the line of scrimmage against the run, but you just don't expect them to get there so soon that they're going to make the tackle in the backfield. Romo is looking to stay perfect on this drive. Batted away. The defender was able to get a hand on it. And really, that came as a result of pretty physical play at the line of scrimmage. They're banging these guys around and not letting them get into their routes. Gets it away cleanly. It'll go out at the 21-yard line. And they take the field again, looking to capitalize on their previous drive, which resulted in a field goal. Left call, left call. They line up in a one-back set. Right, right, right. Let's get it. Come on, dude. Black 20. Black 20. Cut. ADO. Cut. I got him. I got him. Who's left? Cut. And the defense has a heavy rush. The defender got to him just as he threw the ball. And even though that one doesn't go down as a sack, that's one of those that the quarterback remembers and probably rushes him just a little bit on the next throw. Blue 30. Blue 30. Under. 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 Drops back with a pass. Dropped an easy one. An excellent job by the defense of disrupting that last play. And that was really on the wide receiver. Not much of a route, very little separation, and gave the defense a chance to make that play. Back to throw. Passes it. And it's caught. He's dropped at the 36-yard line. That was a good-looking throw. Yeah, great throw, but maybe even a better read. He understood by watching what the defense did after the snap of the football, exactly where to go with that ball. Blue 30, blue 30. Stand in loud. Yo, 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 yo. Touch. Watch the run. Touch. Roethlisberger hands off. He got depleted. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. 
from their own 39-yard line. They line up in a one-back set. Black 20. Black 20. And they use motion. Looks to pass. Scrambles for yardage. Tackled right around the 42-yard line. And they picked up four yards on the scramble. So another third down upcoming for the offense. Big set this time with two tight ends. What a brutal hit. That was a really nasty shot he just took. Ouch, I know that one hurt. And the worst part is that the guys in the offensive huddle are now just looking at their quarterback, seeing if he can call another play. And all the guys on the defense are watching that one on the big screen again. Punts it. It'll go out at the 38-yard line. Let's see if the offense can put something together on this drive. They hand it off. He's tackled right around the 44-yard line. Barbert gains seven yards on that play. They'll need about three yards here on second down. They line up in an eye. They go with the run. And they get him at about the 47-yard line. So the back will come away with a first down on the play. That's the reason you have to just keep giving a guy like this the football. He's able to convert those first downs and wear down a defense. Setting up play action. There for the catch. Defense pushes him out of bounds at about the 33-yard line. What happened there, Chris? Well, they got caught in man-to-man -man coverage on that play, and I couldn't tell if the defender slipped a little bit or not. Maybe he just got beat on the play. Drops back on first down with the pass. He goes up high for the catch. And a big catch for the tight end. And I can tell you this, there's nothing that defensive backs hate more than to have one of those big tight ends in the open field running right towards them. Barber lines up as the single back. It's the tailback. Brought down at the nine. Barber gains around three yards on the run from the nine-yard line. Dallas lines up in a goal line set. And it looked like they jumped early. Full start offense. He needs to pay a little better attention to what he's doing out there. I think those are just embarrassing. You go back to the huddle and you hang your head and you give it, I'm um, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Sometimes those linemen look like little kids when they come back after penalties. The halfback with the carry. He gets out to about the 12-yard line. Barber comes away with two yards on the carry. On the 11 now. And there's two minutes remaining in the half. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. The Cowboys put a man in motion to the left. Romo takes it back. Passes to his left. Tackled at the four. The third down pass got them good yardage, but not quite enough to convert. Yeah, that was a tough third down situation. They got the good completion, a good gain on the play but probably asking too much out of the receiver to try and break that many tackles to pick up that first down. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He'll take it from the two. Dropped at the 31. They had to punt it away on their previous drive. 
First and 10, ball on their own 31. Roethlisberger is in the gun. Four receivers split out. Black 20, black 20. Under, under, come on, under. Go get it, baby. They'll throw on first down. Makes the short throw. Bad luck as he drops it. A great play by the defense to knock the ball away. And these defenders have been close all day. You better be careful if you're the quarterback. One of those is going to turn into an interception. Get that ball back. No, no, no. Blue 30. Blue 30. Come on, y'all. Lock those quick out. Hey, what? Miller goes in motion. Make a stand, D. Let's go. We're up. He's looking to throw. Throws while on the run. He's tackled at about the 39-yard line. Excellent execution on the slant, led to a good gain. Looks to be about nine on the play. Let's go, let's go. Pittsburgh lines up in a double tight set. Black 20. Under, under, under. Come on. Let's go. He's running out of time. There for the reception. He's brought down at the 43-yard line. Good pickup by the receiver. And we've always talked about this receiver's big play ability. He may not be the fastest guy in the league, but you can tell he wants the ball in his hands in big situations. The Steelers will take their second time out of the half. Just a minute to go in the first half of play. Back to pass. Looks down the field. That pass wasn't even close. Yeah, it wasn't close because the big guy was giving him a whack just as he let that one go. He was really under some pressure that time. Drops back. Throws out to the right. He leaves. It's caught. There was some heat on that thing. Yeah, he scored a few style points with that one, but more importantly, they pick up the first down. The Steelers come out in the ace formation. Throws off his back foot into traffic, and it's picked off. Stiff arms, and the defender still makes the tackle. Great catch by the linebacker, not a smart throw from the quarterback. You know, it's hard to believe that you can lose a guy that big, but sometimes those linebackers dropping underneath in coverage, quarterbacks just don't see him, and he threw it right to him. Romo lines up under center. Three receivers are split out wide. Drops back on first down. Tipped pass and picked off. Tackle around the 33-yard line. And he probably should have never thrown the ball. You know, Tom, there are some plays that your coaching staff will tell you, listen, we lost. You know when you step back there and hit that back foot, we lost that play. Just don't make it a disaster. Throw that thing away. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Brought down at the 33-yard line. And the halfback has nowhere to go from the 33-yard line. They line up with one running back in the backfield, three wide. The Steelers will take their last timeout. The set down. The kick is up. It's got the distance. That was a great kick from that distance. It really was, wasn't it? There are no field goal kicker jokes going on on the sideline right now. Just a lot of love. He kicks it off. Jones takes it at the four. Dropped at the 31. The offense will take over at the 31. First down now and 10 to go. Drops back on first down. It's completed. He's tackled at about the 37-yard line. And we've come to halftime here. The score at the halfway mark is the Steelers 12, the Cowboys 6. He kicks it. 
It's fielded at the two. That was a great hit. He wasn't getting away from that one. So as the offense heads back onto the field, we'll take this time to remind you that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. If it's in the game, it's in the game. Drops back, dumps it out left, knocked down, and it's batted away at the last minute by the defenders. Just when it looked like the quarterback might sneak that one in there, a late pass defense and a good play. Two tight end formation this time. Roger, Roger, Roger. Black 20. Now, 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 now. Buffalo, Buffalo. No, no. Come on, man. Dumps it out right. And he's out of bounds, incomplete. The quarterback put that one too far out in front of his receiver, and he couldn't stay in bounds. He tried to make a safe throw there, but the receiver was open. It didn't have to be quite that cautious and just let him out of bounds. Under, under, under. He's looking to throw. Rockets it out. Oh, and he has it go right through his hands. And they can't convert on third and long, so we'll actually see the punting unit here. Newman is back awaiting the punt. Advanced ticket sales and much more. Ask for more details today. It's away and it's a booming punt. Newman feels it at the 29. Huge hit. And that was a nice little punt return there. Wow, I thought he was gone for a second. They did a good job getting to him, at least preventing the touchdown. Of course, they wouldn't have to chase him down like that if they'd have done a better job covering the punt. Drops back to pass. Rifles it to the middle. He's brought down at the 48-yard line. Pretty good gain right there. You have so many people on this offense that you have to account for. The tight ends, the wide receivers, the running backs, even the quarterbacks. And now they're throwing to the fullback. That's almost not fair. Hands it off. Hit hard at the 44-yard line. Barber gains about four yards on the play. It's second and six coming up. Only one man back. Hands it to the back. And they get him at the 40. Barber picks up about four yards on the play. Ace backfield time. Surveys the field. And he catches it off the tip. And a pretty smart play call right there. It really is so much the key to the football. You talk all the time about you have to establish the run. Well, there you see why. You establish the run, and then you come with the play-action pass. Just so hard to defend. And they'll run him again. He doesn't get back to the line. He couldn't get anywhere on that one. Yeah, sometimes you just have to admit defeat on a play as a running back and just try and get that thing back to the line of scrimmage. Little handoff. He gets out to about the 32-yard line. A pickup of a yard for the halfback. That brings up another third down attempt. Romo steps up to the line, three wide receiver. Drops back to pass. He throws it. He's dropped at about the 21. And for as good of a catch as that was, this offense now has to deal with a fourth down. It's good. Good job putting that kick right on target, and it goes through for three points. Kicks it off. Still
still working. They were forced to punt on their last drive. They'll go to work at the 27-yard line. It's first and 10. He's under a heavy rush. He's tackled at the 34. He was lucky to get that one off. He was under a lot of pressure in the pocket. Good play design there. Very solid protection. Gave the quarterback time to examine the whole field until he finally found the open man. Under, under, under. He drops back to pass. Brings it in. He's brought down around the 38-yard line. Holmes picks up about five yards on the first down hookup. Nice job by the quarterback in that situation. He saw the blitz coming, simply got the football out of there and picked up the first down. Throws it. Pass is complete. He's dropped around the 42 yard line. He shows no hesitation and gets it in there to get the first down. Yeah, you wouldn't hesitate either if you were standing back there in the pocket. I say the heck with it. Get it out of there fast. Let somebody else handle it for a little while. Blue 30. Blue 30. Watch the ball. Watch the ball. No, baby. Cut. Someone jumped early down there. Full start. Offense. And that one got him five yards. Well, if you want to know why Pee Wee football coaches make you run a lap if you jump off sides, it's because it can really have a negative impact on your offense, just like that one. The Steelers motion to the left side. They'll give it off here. And he's knocked out at about the 45-yard line. He barely got it past the line of scrimmage that time. That brings up second down. Come on, come on, little hustle, little hustle. Only one man back. Come on, make a play. Blue 30. Blue 30. Get in the lane. Cut. Get ready. Cut. Throws it short. And the receiver is open. Brought down at the 35. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play. Yeah, really a nice route that time. One of the keys to playing wide receiver is the ability to not only get into cuts, but to get out of the cuts. That time, very explosive coming out of that cut, and it made the difference. Miller looked like he had it, but couldn't hang on. He threw that one right into coverage. Well, you can't just stare down one receiver on a play like that. The defense is going to be all over it. He was lucky he didn't get picked off there. Kick is up, and he got all of this one right down the middle. That certainly wasn't your average field goal attempt. And with the way the rules are in the NFL right now, I think that's one of the coach's toughest decisions. Do you just pooch punt it down there, try and pin them back, or go for a long field goal? Boy, that kicker sure helped make that coach look smart there. The offense takes the field, hoping to come away with more than just a field goal on this drive. They line this one up in shotgun. Four wide receivers are split out in the formation. Drops back on first down. Short throw to the right. And the pass is knocked away. The defender got there in time to break that play up. He did. He was able to get his hands on the ball. But if he had missed that one, that one might have turned into a really big play. Looks to pass. Throws out left. Tackled at the 43-yard line. That one worked just as they drew it up. Good pass, good catch, I agree. Sometimes there's really nothing you can do as a defense to stop a well-executed pass play. Witten goes in motion. He didn't get his feet set as he threw, and they get him around the 47-yard line. Great time for that type of pass. It worked to perfection. And that was a nice job by the offensive line, allowing the quarterback enough time to survey the field and find the open guy. 
Feeds it to the back. It's loose. Looks like a defensive lineman might have it. That was a huge turnover. What a tremendous play by the defense. You really began to get the feeling this offense was getting something going. They stripped the football out of there and kill the drive, kill the momentum. They'll start at the 49-yard line. Pittsburgh is going with the offset eye backfield. Roethlisberger sends a man in motion. Under, under, under. Hey, never quit, fellas. Under, under. Raider, Raider, Raider. With the misdirection. He makes a move, and he's brought down. That's four yards on the play, and that will bring up second down. Just keep it on the down low. Don't let your man make the play. Offset eye formation in the backfield. Look, look, look. Goes up on the right. Under, under. Black 20. Under. Black 20. Hey, look the stretch. Look the stretch. Back to throw. Passes to his left. Brought down at the 31. Ben Roethlisberger is really remarkable for not only his ability to avoid pass rushers, but he seems to be able to throw from just about any body position. A lot of guys, when they're throwing across their body or having to make a turn or a weird move, they're not nearly as accurate. But Roethlisberger is just a tremendous athlete. Excellent poise under pressure on that pass play with the defense closing in. He'll take plays like that all day long. The Steelers come out with the offset eye. Drops back. He throws left. He's dropped at the 20. That pass is good for a first down. And he had some zip on that one, didn't he? He reared back and threw that one about as hard as he could. Fakes the run. Passes the line. He's tackled around the 16-yard line. Gets the four yards there on the scramble. Only one man back. Hey, who's in that ball up? Here you go. Black 20. Black 20. Sets up the play action. Henry bats it away. Moore was the intended receiver, and he can't bring it in. Now they'll face a third and six situation. Ball on the 16 yard line. He drops back. Looks for a man open. Is there for the catch. These days, you need a back who has good hands. Yeah, running backs today have to be really complete players. You mentioned the fact they have to be able to catch the football and make plays on the outside. But blocking is so key as well. You have to be able to do it all if you're going to be playing halfback in the NFL. Dropped behind the line. Tried the run, but there was nothing available. And if you could make a running back hesitate just a little, that time you could see there really was no hole, and the running back was just fishing for a place to go. Defense closing in. He steps out right around the two-yard line. Nice pass for the quarterback on that one with the defense bearing down on it. Yeah, very safe, simple play, hitting the underneath receiver for a solid game. Back to throw. He's running out of time. Knocks it away. The defender gets a hand on it, and that will bring up fourth down. I don't know if that's the guy I want to pick on on third down when you have to have a conversion. He is tough. Here's the kick. And he makes it. Nice work putting that one right through the upright. The kick is away. Taken at the five. At the 30, 
at the 40, across midfield, inside the 30, to the 10. What a return! Touchdown! And that just changed the complexion of this game. What a return! Having a kickoff return guy that can return at the distance is such a huge advantage for a team. That's why you're seeing more and more teams around the league drafting guys that can take it to the house. It's good. Not a bad kick. Fielded at the four. He's hammered at the 33 yard line. The offense was only able to muster a field goal on their last drive. We'll see what they do with this possession. Looking for a receiver. Brings this one in. He's brought down at the 45. Ben Roethlisberger just looks like an NFL quarterback, doesn't he? He's tall, he's well-built, he's athletic, he buys time with his feet, and it's probably what most people don't talk about with Roethlisberger, his ability to make that first pass rusher miss and still get off the big plays. He is a tremendous talent. Brought down around the 45-yard line. So at the most, he gains a few inches. That'll bring up second down. Offset eye formation in the backfield. Looking to throw. He needs to make a decision. Pass the line. Tackled at the 45. They weren't ready for a run by the quarterback. Yeah, and the key is making that first pass rusher miss you. More often than not, there's one guy in your way. You can make that first guy miss. A lot of times those defenders have their backs turned and are running away from you. And he will lose yardage on the play. And they can't get anything on the ground. Big run stuff that time by the defense, bringing up fourth down. Tremendous play. Sepulveda is set back, ready to punt. He'll probably try to pooch this one into the corner. He gets it away. Into the end zone for a touchback. Once again, we'll take this opportunity to remind you that this game is brought to you by the fine folks at EA Sports. Romo looking to throw. Dumps it out right. He's brought down at about the 31. A good play to the tight end that time. And tight ends are so big that as coverage people, it's tough to figure out how to defend them. If you're on their left side, they throw it to their right side. If you're behind them, they throw it in front. Tight ends are tough to cover. Looks to pass with the hard throw out to his left. Knocked out of bounds at the 42. Nice little pickup on that pass pattern. And I really shouldn't feel this way, but I get a little nervous every time this guy goes up to make a catch, you know, because he's had a little bit of a history of dropping some balls, but today doing a nice job hanging on and a big play there. He throws right. And they get him at the 47-yard line. Anderson makes the catch for about five yards on the play. Good enough for a first down. Not a big play there, but a nice gain of about five yards and pick up the first down. Romo calls for motion right. Romo hands it off straight ahead. He fights forward to about the 49. So a pickup of maybe three. That brings up second down. Looks like three wideouts this time. Romo back to pass. He's been perfect on this drive. Out of bounds, incomplete. Glenn wasn't able to bring it in. Incomplete pass on the play. Jones takes the delayed handoff. 
and he makes it out to about the 47-yard line. Probably the right call, but just couldn't get the yardage they needed. Yeah, I'm okay with the call there, too. It just wasn't executed like the coach did. McBriar kicks it away, and did he ever get a hold of this one? Goes into the end zone for a touchback. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. Parker is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Under, 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 under. Go get it, baby. Go nothing, change. Go get that ball back. They hand it off. Fumble on the play. The offense retains possession. He put it on the ground, but they were able to get it back. And that was lucky. Anytime you're getting attacked by a defense and you put it on the ground, that is just nothing but pure luck to get it back. Black 20. Black 20. Under. 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 The halfback with the carry. Down the sideline. Got him down at the 45-yard line. That was an excellent run. Did you see how fast he shot through that line of scrimmage? Not just the ability once you get in the open field to break out and run, but when you see that kind of speed and acceleration through the hole, that's pretty impressive. From the 45-yard line, the Steelers come out in the ace formation. Here we go. First down, looking to throw. Surveys the field. Hamlin knocks it down. And he just managed to get a piece of it. Nice play by the defender. And as a receiver, you really have to do a better job of coming back to the football at that point. You have to help the quarterback. Black 20. Black 20. Nasty, nasty. Let's go. Drops back. He throws on the run. He's dropped at the 38, a pickup of about seven. The offense needs about three yards to get the first here on third down. The pocket is collapsing. He's brought down around the 21-yard line. Another completed pass puts him over the 300-yard mark. And you know, this guy just loves to play football. I really like talking to him before the game. You can hear the passion in his voice. And when you have a leader that has that kind of passion and that kind of emotion, it's just so much easier to play the game. Set. Black 20. Black 20. Let's turn the ball over. Drops back on first down. Comes down with it. Brought down at the 17. Nice pass and catch on that play that gets them a lot closer. Yep, and that's really just the way they drew that one up. You take what the defense gives, looking to move the ball efficiently downfield with intermediate passes. Brought down behind the line. The defense just ate up that play. Well, those defenders get paid too, and every once in a while they win the battle. Clearly that time they were all over this offensive line. Back to pass. Throws on the run. It'll be first and goal. He gunned that one in there for the first down, didn't he? He really did. And when you watch a guy throw a ball that hard, they don't move their arm any faster. You see him driving off that back leg. That was a pretty pass. Let's stop it right now. Go for right. Take it for a three. Take it the And he scores. What a play. You know, I think sometimes Willie Parker gets a bit of a knock because he's not an overwhelming, powerful kind of a back like they've had so many of in Pittsburgh over the years. But when you're talking about a guy, when he gets down around the goal line, even if there is some traffic, he's willing to stick his head in there, 
But no question about it, still his greatest attribute is that tremendous speed. Kick is up. Point after is good. And now we'll take a quick look at the drive summary. He gets his leg into this one. Brought down at the 28-yard line. They couldn't do anything against this defense on their last drive, and they were forced to punt. The Cowboys line up with an offset eye backfield. Romo hands it off. And they get him at the 30. Barber comes away with two yards on the carry. Offset eye formation in the backfield. Back to throw. Here's the pass. Falls incomplete. He was hurried on that last play. You bring a little pressure and it impacts quarterbacks and we saw it there. He's looking to throw. Looks for a man open. Makes the catch. Oh boy, that's a nice play on third down. Clutch play by the receiver that time on third down. As a receiver, you really have to just flat out want the ball in that situation. You can tell that this guy really does. Little handoff. He's tackled at the 41-yard line. Barber picks up two yards with the carry. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 41. Single back formation, three wide receivers. Romo drops back. Throws it short. And it's completed. Witten grabbed that one for a gain of two. So that'll make it third down. Dallas goes with the ace set here. Drops back. Dumps it out left. He's brought down at the 43-yard line. That was a big-time play by the receiver. And talking to this receiver earlier this week, he told me he had a lot of plays in the playbook, and he thought he was going to have a big day. He looks to throw on first down. On the run, he throws it. Tackled at the 33-yard line. He's put up some nice yardage. Here. He sure has, but throwing for 300 yards probably isn't quite the same feat it used to be. You know, there's so many rule changes now. The offensive linemen can do a little more holding, use their hands more. Of course, you can't hit the receivers, but it's still a nice landmark. Drops back on first down. Fires it left. He's tackled around the 24-yard line. And another connection that goes for good yarding. And we really see the trust that is developing between this receiver and the quarterback. That if the quarterback has confidence that you're going to be where he thinks you're going to be, he will throw it to you more often than he'll throw it to somebody else. He's finally pushed out of bounds. It's going to be first and goal. You can tell these guys practice that play quite a bit. Yeah, I can remember hearing stories about uh, old-time players in the NFL that literally they could go out in the pitch black and make throws and catches without really even seeing the ball. That's the kind of timing we're seeing today. What a hit! The running back gains two yards on the carry. Boy, he just took a shot on that one as a running back. The last thing in the world you want is a short gain and a big hit. Makes a move and he's in. Touchdown! Romo did a great job to find the seam and get in for the touchdown. So they're ready for the extra point. Uh, 
and the point after is good. And here's your drive summary for that last series. Here's the kick. He'll return it from the one. And he gets brought down hard. So as the offense heads back onto the field, we'll take this time to remind you that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. If it's in the game, it's in the game. Roethlisberger with the give. He's dropped at the 35. They call his number and he carries for six yards. From their own 35-yard line. Offset eye formation in the backfield. Brought down at the 48-yard line. Without a doubt, he showed off his incredible speed on that play. You know, not only the top-end speed, which is so impressive, but speed in and out of his cuts, that's the difference in a great running back. Anytime you can see a guy maintain that speed out of his cuts, that's a guy that has superstar ability. A gain of a yard, if anything, on the run. Roethlisberger is in the shotgun. He has three receivers split out wide. Under heavy pressure. Lack of concentration as it bounces away. What an effort out there. He just got his hands in there and broke it up. I love watching the closing speed of this defense. When they see the ball, they go get it. Black 20. Under. 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 Tackled at the 46-yard line. He did what he could, but it still won't be enough for a first down. And defensively, they'll give you a run like that. I mean, it's third down and long situation. And if you want to simply hand the ball off, take it. We'll let you punt the football, and we'll go back and drink some uh, little water. Punts it. Down in the end zone for a touchback. And they take the field with one thing on their mind, another scoring drive. Barber gets the carry. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. It's three yards there. Well, that time the outside linebacker came on the run blitz. They got some penetration and shut down the play. The Cowboys line up with two tight ends. He didn't get back to the line. He tries to wriggle away, but he stopped for a loss. Well, Tom, the offensive line just didn't get any push there. They've got to do a better job knocking those guys off the line of scrimmage. Drops back to pass. Passes. And he should have had that one. It's a tough situation. What would you do here, Chris? Well, it just depends on how much you trust your defense to get the football back. This other team has a lot of offensive weapons. Tough decision here. McBriar punts it, and he really got a leg into this one. Holmes fields it at the 30. He tries to spin and he is dropped. The defense could do no wrong the last time this team had the ball. They'll go to work at the 41-yard line. It's first and 10. One man in the backfield. Rifles it out there. He's dropped right around the 50-yard line. Good job locating the gap in the coverage on that play. You know, that's the kind of pass pattern I used to always love to run because if the defense is even a little bit lax in their coverage, it's pretty easy to get that one in there. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. He's tackled at the 46-yard line. 
Decent run there to pick up the first down. Oh, that's going to be a tough day for the defender in the film room after that one. Anytime an NFL running back can juke you like that and pick up a first down, it's a little embarrassing. Drops back. Short throw to the right. Makes the reception. Brought down at the 41-yard line. Around five yards on the throw that time. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 41-yard line. The Steelers line up with trips bunched on the left side. Black 20. Down, down, down. Under, under, under. Looking to throw. Goes through his read. Completed. He's brought down at the 30. And a nice pass to the tight end. So much of the game today revolves around those substitution packages, trying to bring extra defensive backs on the field to try and help against the pass. But when you have a big receiving tight end, that really makes that plan awfully tough to execute. Left call, left call. Gives it off. And he's drilled at the 28-yard line. A yard, maybe two, on the carry. Roethlisberger steps up to the line. Three wide receiver. Black 20. Black 20. Hey, we gotta watch the ball, y'all. He's looking to throw. End zone. He brings it in. Touchdown. You know, doing the highlight shows that I do, it just seems like every week is the Ben Roethlisberger show. You know, you see him always making the pass rushers miss and scrambling out and making a play and making a big throw just week after week a very consistent a very talented quarterback up and good here's a quick look at the drive summary the kick Austin takes it from the six. Hit and dropped at the 33-yard line. Their last drive ended with a three and out. They'll start this drive at the 33. It's first and 10. The defense sets up in the nickel. Romo gives it up the middle. He's dropped at the 38. Gain of five on the play, and that will bring up second down. Barber is the lone setback with four receivers in the formation. Back to pass. All kinds of pressure. Batted away. The pass was deflected and swatted away by the defender. I think the quarterback may have had to throw that ball a little sooner than he wanted to. The pressure was starting to get there. He drops back to pass. He throws right. And it's picked. Brought down at the 37. Why did he even make that pass? You know, Tom, I think he got baited into that throw. He thought the defensive back was going elsewhere. He did a little fake, came back in, made the pick. Just a real heads-up play. They hand it off. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. The running back gains two yards on the carry. Ace backfield this time. And they motion a guy to the right. He decides to run, and they get him at the 27. He picks up a good seven yards there on the quarterback keeper. Roethlisberger steps to the line of scrimmage. They'll come out in an eye. And straight ahead we go with the fullback. He's tackled at the 25. Good run there to pick up the first. Every once in a while, it's just sort of fun to see the big fella pound one in there, take advantage of his size, and pick up a first down. And they use motion. Cut. Cut. 
Drops back on first down. Goes for the end zone. Williams bats it down, and the defender breaks up the play. Just great position that time on the defensive side. The receiver really never had a chance on that one. Offset eye formation in the backfield. Back to throw. Short pass to his left. He's dropped at the 18-yard line. Seven yards there. Third and three. Ball on the 18-yard line. They line up in a double tight set. Into the end zone for a touchdown. The running back finds the end zone again. Consistency, that's what this guy brings to your team. It's like that old beat up robe that you love to wear. Your wife hates it, you love it. You know it's gonna keep you warm. And it's consistently just treating you right over the years. That's what this guy brings. His best performance, game in and game out. Here we go. Blue 30, blue 30. He'll try the end zone. He catches the two-point conversion. Great job there. They were able to convert. And you could tell the offense had a plan throughout that drive. Not only did they get the touchdown, but they immediately got the call in for the two-point conversion. They knew exactly what they wanted to do and executed it perfectly. Drill at the 28-yard line. On his last drive, the quarterback completed a pass, but to the other team. Throwing another one could be disastrous to this offense. They'll throw on first down. Surveys the field. Right through his hands, he almost had the pick. Witten was the intended receiver on the play, and it falls incomplete. Second down, 10 yards to go. Single set backfield. Back to pass. Dumps it out left. He's brought down around the 32-yard line. Three, call it four on the completion. Good job by the offense that time. Really nothing there down the field. He just takes a little completion and keeps moving the ball. Dallas sends a man in motion to the right. Romo back to throw. Throws it. Oh, you got to catch that. Creighton was his intended target on that one, but they can't complete the pass. It's fourth down. Looks like they'll kick it away here. McBriar to punt. McBriar kicks it, and man, did he get a leg into this one. And they make the fair catch. Their previous two trips downfield were a success, and they take the field hoping for a third. The backfield is in the offset I formation. Black 20. Black 20. Hey, regular. Roethlisberger gives it up the middle. Brought down at the 23. Pick up of less than a yard. That'll bring up second down. Second and nine. Ball on the 23-yard line. The Steelers come out in the single back formation. Three receivers wide. We have two minutes left to play in this game. It's second down and nine to go. Ball on the 23. And they use motion. Setting up play action. Passes it out. And for some reason, they pass the ball, and that will stop the clock. Not sure what they were thinking. Well, just about the time you were thinking they were going to try and run this clock out, they go out and they're aggressive, but now the clock stops. Play action. Looks down the field. It's incomplete. They went with a sideline pass, but he couldn't stay in bound. And that would have been a spectacular catch if he'd been able to come up with that one, just thrown a little bit too far outside. Uh, 
He gets it away. Newman fields it at the 40. Loose ball, and they keep control of the ball. To the 20, to the 10. And a big change in momentum right there. You know, Tom, I just get the feeling he was trying to make too much happen out there. Sometimes you just get the ball, get what you can, and get on the ground. You cannot afford to cough it up there. Here's the give. He's hammered in the backfield. A great defensive effort there. Did you see how fast that linebacker was on that one? Not only did he recognize it, but when he did recognize it, he had the explosiveness to get there. Passes, end zone. Henry bats it down. I thought for sure they'd try to run out the clock. Well, Tom, you and I have watched enough football over the years that if you try to get inside the heads of these head coaches, it's a frightening place sometimes. Black 20. Cut. Let's go, let's go. Cut. hands it left. And they get him around the three-yard line. A gain of a yard, if anything, on the run. And he makes it. He put that one right through the upright. And we'll take a quick look at the drive summary. Here's the kick. It's fielded at the two. That was a great hit. He wasn't getting away from that one. Once again, we'll take this opportunity to remind you that this game is brought to you by the fine folks at EA Sports. Drops back to pass. Gets the throw away. Can't stay in bounds. Incomplete pass. He couldn't get two feet in on that one. Well, that's something receivers work on all the time, dragging that back toe, just unable to do it that time. Romo back to pass. Scans the field. Makes the grab. He's brought down around the 37-yard line and simply a great throw there. Yeah, that really was a nice touch that time. Perfect uh, sort of combination of velocity and touch. A very catchable ball thrown by this quarterback so that you don't have to overly focus on what you're doing and you can get your eyes back down the field, try and get a good run after the catch. On play action, he throws a bullet across the middle. He's dropped at the 49-yard line. It looks like they're going to go no huddle. One man in the backfield. The offense calls a timeout, and that was their last timeout. It's first and 10. Ball on the 49. Drops back to pass. Looking for an open man. Brought down at the 38. Another positive gain, and that gives him 100 yards receiving for the game. And this guy just knows how to make plays. He's somebody, we've watched him throughout the course of his career, but especially here today, constantly in big situations making plays. And they get him at the 24-yard line. And this one-sided affair will come to a close. Our score, the Steelers 43, the Cowboys 23.